Hello beautiful people, my name is Mildred, welcome to my YouTube channel and welcome to my very second video of the year and of this channel's existence. Um, I hope y'all are having a great start to the year and to the decade. So I'm back with another Q&A session and uh, today I have about 8 questions I've selected to go through and just answer. So without further ado, I will start with the first question, which is, what's your favorite holiday? My favorite holiday would be when I went to New York City in October last year. I went to New York with a friend and we met another friend there. It was like a girl's trip kind of thing, which was really interesting and fun. We, <laughs> it was a really nice holiday. We got to see a lot of places and we met amazing people, amazing people, I tell you. Uh, so that would be my very favorite holiday of all time. We don't know what's more to come, but yeah, that was my favorite holiday. So guys, these are a few snippets from the holiday I was talking about. As you can see, it's New York. It's loud and big and beautiful at the same time in all its glory but yeah i really enjoyed my time here um the second question what's your opinion on reality tv shows Yay! honestly i don't care for them that much i have never like even watched a whole episode of a reality tv show i just don't get the concept behind them and i Honestly, don't don't enjoy watching people's lives on TV while I could be doing something else with my time. I'm not saying people who watch reality TV shows are, you know. <laughs> I'm just saying I personally don't enjoy them. And our third question is, do you believe in love at first sight? <laughs> love at first sight. I... I will say I'm in no position to answer that question right now. But I'll just shed, uh, give my two cents on the whole topic and say I, I think it might be a thing, but the whole concept of love, like intimate love and all that is kind of, I don't know. <laughs> I haven't really experienced love in such a way, so I'll just say I will pass. <laughs> and the fourth question is, would you ever consider living abroad? Would you ever consider living abroad? I uh, Yes. As I said in my previous video, I'm from Botswana. But right now, I'm currently living in the United States of America. And um, I don't think I'll live abroad permanently, though. I'm just here for my studies. And once I'm done with school, I'm going to go back home. I'm definitely going back home. So living abroad permanently would be a no-no for me. But yeah. And moving on to the fifth question. Do you have a tattoo? Um, I do not have a tattoo. I don't even think I'm ever going to get one. Um, I don't have a problem with tattoos. I just don't know if I would be happy with myself in 50 years with a tattoo on my butt. <laughs> yeah, well, you get the, the drift. I The whole idea of having a tattoo fascinates me, but I'm pretty sure I'm never going to get one. The sixth question is, would you rather have infinite money or unending love today's questions are just so difficult <sighs> between money and love i would definitely go for love i think having people who love you surrounding you is a great thing whether you are broke or rich it's really not i believe money cannot buy happiness and happiness is what i'm going for in this life no matter what so unending love would definitely make me a happy person so yeah Yay! the seventh question would you rather have an american accent or a british accent 
my answer is none of the above i am pretty happy with my accent i'm okay with the way i speak some people might find it odd but i am totally fine with the way i speak i actually love it it's unique and it makes me like <laughs> it sets me apart i guess but if it were a life and death situation i would say a british accent i just like the way the brits speak and uh how <laughs> how like every single syllable in their speech is pronounced so if i were to choose between the two i would say a british accent yeah and the eighth and final question of this session if you could change one thing that happened what would it be <sighs> let me think for a moment <laughs> Honestly, I would not change anything that has ever happened to me. I believe the experiences I've been through, every single thing, good or bad, has made me the person I am today and I'm happy with that person. So changing those might possibly make me either into a bit like a happier person or a sadder person and at the moment i'm happy being in the middle <laughs> i don't know if that makes sense but yeah i would honestly not change a thing and i don't think i've ever experienced anything like life shattering or anything like that maybe once or twice but those events shaped me so i honestly wouldn't want to change anything and that's the end of the Q&A session. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video as much as I did making it for you. And I hope you like, subscribe as well as share it with your friends. Make sure you hit the notification bell so that whenever, um, whenever I post, you get the notification and are the first to view my videos. And with that being said, don't forget it's a new year, a new decade. Uh, make something great of yourself and just enjoy life.